Well, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Ted Line Gymnasium. We've got senior girls basketball action tonight between the visiting County Line Lady Indians and your Lady Little John. I want to thank our sponsors tonight, ArcWest Communication, Chambers Bank, Chambers Memorial Hospital, State Farm Insurance, Cornell's Funeral Home, Danville Gifts and More, and Brooklyn's Beauty Lounge for sponsoring tonight's ball game, allowing us to be able to bring you this action. So you, if you couldn't be here, at least you can watch it. That's Addie Wright, try for a three off the mark. I'm going to apologize. I do not have a roster for the Lady Indians. But on the floor for the Lady Little Johns, number two, Mia Kissling, number five, Presley Morris, 22, Zamory Hilton, 23, Kylie Frost, and number 20 is Addie Wright. Addie Wright blocks the shot. The Lady Little Johns come away with it. Mia Kissling with the rebound. Uh, Lady Little John's hustling, getting second opportunities. There's a whistle and a foul. That will put Kylie Frost at the free throw line for the Lady Little John's. Six minutes, 35 seconds. Player control foul is going to be called against Mia Kissling. Mia Kissling with the rebound for the Lady Little John, six minutes remaining. Morris with the steal. She pulls it up, didn't have the numbers. We're down to five minutes remaining here in this opening period in a scoreless game. Both teams just off the mark with their shots. Ashley Moore, strife three off the mark. Battle for the rebound. Ball goes out of bounds off the Lady Indians. Four minutes, 33 seconds remaining here in the opening period. I think they've got a lid on both ends. We're down to four minutes, 10 seconds remaining, almost all the way halfway through this opening period. 
We are halfway through this opening period and we've got a scoreless ball game. Frost lays it up and off the glass with her left hand, gives the Lady Little Johns a two-point advantage. Three minutes, 35 seconds remaining here in the opening period. Jump ball position, Earl stays with the Lady Indians. Ashley Morris with a good job on that rebound. Goes to the floor. Has a, her head about her enough to start dribbling on the way down. But she does get tied up. But the possession arrow does belong to the Lady Little Johns. Two minutes remaining here in this opening period. Still two to nothing. Knocking down a three-pointer. They lead by one, three to two. One minute, five seconds remaining. Golly Frost knocks down a three-pointer for the lady. Little Johns. the rebound, 40 seconds remaining. Yeah. 
Hilton knocking down a two-pointer for the Lady Little Johns. 15 seconds remaining, seven to three. Brings us to the end of the first period where the Lady Little Johns lead seven to three. As we begin this second period, the Lady Indians trailing by four have the first position. Be at the free throw line for the Lady Little Johns. Says still seven to three, six twenty-eight on the clock as Amory Hilton knocks down. your score six minutes ten seconds remaining here in this second period after that three-pointer got a two-point ball game with six minutes remaining eight to six County line Lady Indians inbound the basketball. Two point ball game, five minutes, 35 seconds remaining. Johns get it in Amory Hilton whistle and a foul will put her at the free throw line Amory knock 
knocks down another free throw for the Lady Little Johns. Five minutes, seven seconds. Ten six is your score. Five minutes remaining here in this second period. There's a steal by Amory Hilton. Takes it the length of the floor, lays it up and in. Twelve to six. Timeout. Lady Indians. After the late Indian timeout, they inbound it, trailing by six, four minutes, 30 seconds remaining here in this second period. Mia Kissling with the rebound. She'll wisely pull it up for the Lady Little Johns didn't have the numbers. Four minutes remaining. Three-point basket. Makes it a three-point ball game, 12 to nine. Addie Wright pulls the trigger on a three long three-pointer ball out of bounds, belongs to the Lady Indians. one of two at the free throw line. Two minutes, 46 seconds remaining here in the second period. Kylie Frost with the pushes it down for the Lady Little Johns. Mia Kissling called for the player control foul. End of the ball game, number five, Carly Bottoms. Seven seconds. A one point ball game after that shot.
Presley Morris. Knocking down that three-pointer. One of the fouls going to be called against number 15, Addison White. One minute, four seconds remaining as the Lady Little John's inbound it. Whistle and a foul is going to be called against Kylie Frost. <laughs> Traveling violation turns the ball back over to the Lady Little Johns. 51.2 seconds on the clock. Ashley Morris try for three off the mark. Amory Hilton with the rebound kicks it out to Addison Wright. Player control foul called against Addie Wright. One a foul called against, I believe it was Amory Hilton. Shay Millam into the ball game number three for the Lady Lions. Jolie Robinson knocking down free throw, makes it a three-point ball game, 16, 13, 20 seconds remaining. Jump ball with 4.6 seconds. Lady Little Johns will have the possession arrow in their favor. One point five seconds remaining here in the opening half. Jasmine Presley Morris couldn't get her shot off. And that'll take us to halftime with the Lady Little Johns leading by three, 16 to 13. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, as we begin this second half of this senior girls basketball game.
as we begin this second half. Senior Lady Lions have the first possession, trailing by three, 16 to 13. Your Lady Indians on the floor, number 24, Kayla Appleton. Number five is Carly Bottoms. Number 11, Jolie Robinson. Number three is Shea Millam. That's Addie Wright for the Lady Little Johns, knocking down that three-pointer. She's joined on the floor by number 22, Emery Hilton. 23 is Kylie Frost. Number two, Mia Kissling. And number five is Presley Morris. Whistle and a foul will put Jolie Robinson at the free throw line for the Lady Indians. Not sure who they called the foul on, didn't see the number. But Jolie knocks down the first of two free throws, makes it a five point ball game. And with that free throw, four point ball game, 19 to 15. Addie Wright, try for three, good. 22 to 15, seven point advantage for the Lady Little Johns. Three-pointer off the mark, but the Lady Lions get their own rebound. And they turn it over near midcourt. Lady Little Johns will inbound at six minutes, 21 seconds remaining here in this third period. Again, 22 to 15 as Presley Morris will inbound it for the Lady Little Johns. Gets it in to Mia Kissling. Again, I apologize for not having a roster for the Lady Lions as we, Lady Indians, I'm sorry. I don't know where I'm getting the lines. Lady Indians. I guess my county line part come is rubbing off. County line Lady Indians. Battle for the rebound. Lady Indians come away with it. Five minutes, 50 seconds remaining here in this third period. Kylie Frost with the rebound for the Lady Little Johns. Still, but Jolie Robinson takes the length of the floor, puts shot up, no good. Kylie Frost there for the rebound for the Lady Little Johns. Five minutes, 15 seconds remaining. Addie Wright drive shot up, no good. Whistle and a foul will put Addie at the free throw line. Shea Millam will pick up the foul. Knocking down both free throws for the Lady Little Johns. Timeout, Lady Indian. After the Lady Indian timeout, they inbound it. Trailing 24 to 15, five minutes, 10 seconds remaining. Three-point basket. Carly Bottoms. Amory Hilton couldn't get her shot to go down. Nice give and go, but she couldn't get her shot to go down. Lady Indians come out of there, push it down the floor. Ball 
out of bounds belongs to the Lady Little Johns. Four minutes, 30 seconds remaining. 24 to 18. Sling shot off the mark, but the ball goes out of bounds off the lady Indians. Ball knocked out of bounds by the lady Indians. Player control foul called on Addie Rat. Mia Kissling with the rebound. Gives it up to Addie Wright, Triton for three, good. 27 to 18, 345 remaining here in this third period. Addie yeah. Wright blocks the shot of Carly Bottoms. Lady Little Johns push it down the other way. Frost gets her own rebound, gets it off to Addie Wright. Shot no good. Battle for the rebound. That's number 24. Kyla Appleton with it. Jolie Robinson couldn't get her shot to come down. Presley Morris with the rebound for the Lady Little Johns. Player control foul called against Kylie Frost. Hammer Hilton comes out of there with a the loose ball down court pass to Eddie Wright up and in. Count the bucket, she draws the foul. Carly Bottoms picking the foul up. Into the ball game number 10 for the Lady Little John, Jasmine Patricio. Addie knocks down the free throw, makes it a 12 point ball game, 30 to 18. Kissling. With the rebound, draws a foul. Foul was number on number 11, Jolie Robinson. Into the ball game. Number 12, Cheyenne Wells. Sorry, that's number 32, Virginia. Beezer, traveling violation, turns the ball over to the Lady Indians. Two minutes, 12 seconds remaining here in this third period.
offensive foul called against the Lady Indians for an illegal screen. Player control foul called against Amory Hilton. Presley Morris drives, couldn't get her shot to go down. Amory Hilton there for the rebound. Ashley tried for three off the mark. Mia Kissling there. Her put back up and in good. 32 to 18, 120 remaining here in this third period. Amory Hilton picking up the foul. and Gilkey into the game for the Lady Little Johns. 114 remaining here in this third period. Addie Wright with the rebound off the missed free throw for the Lady Little Johns. Addie's three in and out, no good. Rebound comes off to Appleton. Jolie Robinson with the bucket. 32 to 20. 45 seconds remaining. Jolie Robinson picking up the foul. Puts Addison Gilkey at the free throw line for the Lady Little Johns. for the Lady Little Johns. 34 to 20 is your score. 30 seconds remaining here in the third period. And right. Pulls down a rebound off at Jolie Robinson. Miss. Jasmine Patricio's three up, no good. Whistle and a foul. We'll put Jasmine at the free throw line. Jasmine comes away empty at the free throw line. And that'll bring us to the end of the third period where the Lady Little Johns lead 34 to 20. Lady Little Johns have the first possession as we begin this fourth period. They have a 14-point lead, 34 to 20, over the visiting county line, Lady Indians.
foul going to be called against Shea Millam. Frost shot up no good battle for the rebound ball goes out of bounds stays with the Lady Little Johns down another three for the Lady Little Johns. 37 to 27 minutes, 15 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. Addie Wright pulls down a rebound off the Kyla Appleton miss. Kissling try for three off the mark. Rebound comes off to Shea Millam of the Lady Indians. to the Lady Indians. Six minutes and 19 seconds. Right, try for three, no good. Rebound chased down by the Lady Indians. Good defense for Presley Morris. Addy right pulling down the rebound. She'll set the Lady Little John offense up. Three, no good rebound. Mia Kissling, her shot up, no good. Kylie Frost is there. Gets her third rebound. Lady Indians come out of there with it. Robinson pushes it down. Battle for the rebound. Robinson has it. She's tied up. We'll have a jump ball possession. There belongs to the Lady Indians. Back into the ball game. Amory Hilton. Jasmine Patricio will take a seat for the Lady Little Johns. Four minutes, 54 seconds remaining. <laughs> Time out. Time out, Lady Little Johns inbound. Jump ball position will stays with the Lady Little Johns. Inbound pass. 
pass goes to Amory Hilton, puts it up and in 39-20. Four minutes, 35 seconds remaining here in the ball game. Robinson couldn't get her shot to go down. Kissling there for the Lady Little Johns. Ashley Morris couldn't get her shot to go down. Rebound comes off to the Lady Indians. Four minutes remaining. Mia Kissling with another rebound for the Lady Little Johns. Three minutes, 45 seconds. Shot off the mark, rebound comes off to Robinson of the Lady Indians. Player control foul going to be called against Robinson. Frost drive for three, no good rebound comes off to the Lady Indians. Two minutes, 45 seconds remaining here in the ball game. 39-20 remains your score. Amory Hilton pulls down a rebound, draws a foul. Jump ball possession arrow belongs to the Lady Indians. Two minutes, 25 seconds remaining. Timeout, Lady. After the timeout, Lady Indians inbound at two minutes, 20 seconds remaining. Robinson puts it up and off the glass. 39-22. Amory <laughs> Hilton. Pulls it down, gets it across the midcourt stripe, pulls it up. Lady Little Johns will set up their offense. A minute and 40 seconds remaining. Nice pass from Amory Hilton down low to Addie Wright. Wholesale substitution for the Lady Indians.
on substitute. One minute remaining. for the blocking foul, 33.1 seconds. Forty-one twenty-four, thirty seconds remaining. Defeat the Lady Indians 41 24. 